in the initial Millennial Declaration, the root of the first generation of Millennium Development Goals, rights was largely left out. These goals were a measure of successful outcomes of any kind of development. More kids in school, uh, better health care and child survival rates, a conservation of the environment, clean drinking water. These kinds of things were measures of any developing economy's success. They don't address issues of inequality. They don't address issues of governance. The Millennium Development Goals leave one huge gaping hole, which is every human being's yearning to ensure that there's justice. An opportunity has arisen in connection with the Millennium Development Goals to link justice with development. What we ought to do is to have justice as the backgrounding, rallying cry, rather than saying, here, give me an index of justice. O acesso à justiça, ele é justamente a ponte entre os direitos, entre a Constituição, entre aquilo que está no papel e a transformação da vida de uma pessoa. Ponte entre uma coisa e outra é o acesso à justiça. There's a shift in thinking where people are saying that in order to promote civil and political rights, you've got to deal with socioeconomic rights, but underpinning all of that, your entire rights framework has to be some basic element of, of justice. Why is justice key to development? I think it's everywhere. The sense of fairness, of balance, is essential to inclusion, to ownership. 